X350 John Deere disabling the reversed button. You will need to make a jumper. I have no idea how to do it, but it's very, very easy. I went to my local hardware tractor store, got some 14 gauge wire, used some strippers. It says right on the little stripper 14, so I stripped off about an inch of metal on the end. Then I used another tool and crimped on, get out two male little connectors. This says male and female disconnects, disconnects, and you will want the one that looks like that. So I crimped those in and then put some electrical tape around it. Make sure it's about two or three inches of yellow and green wire. Right there's our plug. Let's see if I can get it out. Everybody makes it, oh, and it does. They make it look like you just pull it out and it does. So I'm now going to plug my wire in. I hid it from you. No, it snapped in real easy. So assuming this is gonna work, just tuck this wire back up underneath there. And that way you can take that little jumper out if you have to take it in for any work or warranty work. All right, try to figure out how to hold the camera. I felt bad I didn't get that on video for you. Snap it in. Snap it in. That's it. Make sure you hear two little snaps. I felt bad. You guys didn't get to see that the first video, so I'm going to edit that in. We're gonna test it live. Here we go. Mower deck on. Forward. Oh wait. Oh wait, I wanna back up. Reverse. <laughs> Thank you for watching. If you like different videos about detailing cars, motorcycles, that kind of stuff, new tools and tips and tricks, think about subscribing to my channel. Thanks guys.